journey into the higher realms to receive the Christ light and a divine blessing from Seraphim Bokpi and Master Jesus. Today we're going on a journey to visit the Borodau yew trees in Cumbria. Cumbria is in the west of England bordering Scotland. The largest yew tree found here is over seven meters in girth and can hold up to four people inside its hollow trunk. These ancient yew trees are thought to be around 2,000 years old, making them amongst the oldest living trees in the UK. The famous poet William Wordsworth even wrote a poem about them. The yew is a sacred tree that holds a spiritual connection to Master Jesus and the Christ Consciousness. The yew itself is a symbol of resurrection and eternity. The yew tree you are going to be working with today is a portal. It is through the energy and stability of this yew that we are going to travel in consciousness to the higher realms. Here you will be greeted by Seraphim Bokpi and Master Jesus. Not only will you receive the Christ blessing, Christ light, but also your monadic family that connects you with Source, our Creator. Your monadic family exists within different time frames, realities and dimensions. Now let us prepare ourselves and make sacred space together. Please adjust your body so that you are nice and comfortable. Quieten your mind by focusing on your natural breathing rhythm for a moment or two. Now, with a little more concentration, I would like you to breathe in through your nostrils and out through your mouth. Again, breathe in through your nostrils and out through your mouth. Now, as you inhale, Slowly draw the energy up from your root chakra, located at the base of your spine. Bring it all the way up through your torso and release on the exhale through your mouth all unwanted energy. Once more, as you pull the energy up, you are drawing up unwanted energy, such as tension and stress. And on the out breath through your mouth, let go of this tension and stress that you are holding on to. Continue this for two more rounds. Breathing in through your nostrils, and out through your mouth. Breathe in through your nostrils and out through your mouth. And as you exhale, you are releasing all that no longer serves you. Now return to your natural breathing rhythm. Please know that this meditation is not a test. It really does not matter if you cannot visualize or sense or feel anything. 
Have no expectation, but please trust and know that you and your monadic family will receive the Christ light and the Christ blessing. Now we're going to call upon Archangel Mikael and his legion of angels to place you within his golden dome of divine protection. Archangel Mikael on Most High, please come, please be with me. Please place your deep blue cloak of protection around me. Keep me safe from all lower vibrational energies, seen and unseen. Now just imagine that Archangel Mikael will sense his energies standing before you placing his deep blue cloak of protection around you, bringing a hood up over your head and covering your third eye. He then kneels to zip up your cloak. Know that you are protected. Thank you, Archangel Mikael. We also ask for the spirit of the crow to fly around you, to keep watch and to protect you for the duration of this meditation. Now we affirm that we wish to be connected to the frequency of unconditional love and to the divine love aspect. We call upon your higher self, your I am presence, your monadic family, and your teams in spirit of the highest light and resonance to guide and to support you. We ask for your bird totems to be with you upon this journey. as I now, on behalf of you, call in Seraphim Bokpi. Seraphim Bokpi, most high on light, come in. Come in, Seraphim Bokpi, most high on light. On most high open portal to the Christ consciousness, Come in Christ Consciousness and Master Jesus on Most Love. Come in Monad, Monad come in. Monad to open, Monad to receive. Seraphim Bokpi, Master Jesus, please start activation. Master Jesus on Most Love, please assist with the downpouring of the Christ light and blessing. Thank you. So that you do not fall asleep during this meditation, please ground yourself in a way that you are most familiar with. Or for ease, we can call in Archangel Sandalphon together to anchor your grounding cords into your earth star chakra, which automatically connects you with the energy of Mother Earth. We call and invoke forth Archangel Sandalphon. Archangel Sandalphon, please come, please be with us. Please anchor our grounding cords into our earth star chakra. Please connect us to Mother Earth. Thank you. Now let us go on a journey together as we take the pathway towards the trees. And remember, imagination is all you need. As you stand within the Borodao Valley, you see before you an old but solid pack horse stone bridge. 
Beneath the bridge is a shallow crystal clear stream and the ambient sound of trickling water soothes and calms you. Placing one foot in front of the other, you cross over the bridge and head towards the gate that is on your left hand side. You notice that there is a signpost indicating a public footpath and you head towards it. Pass through the gate that you see before you and then take a left turn. You will shortly come to a second gate to which you will pass through. Allow yourself to notice what these gates look like in detail. What colour are they? What are they made of? As you now step onto the public footpath, you see that it winds along the shallow stream. Looking around, you see that there are several gnarly ancient looking trees and you wonder how long they have stood upon this sacred land. You catch sight of a pair of goldfinches as they dart across the terrain, leaving a trail of golden and red and yellow light in their wake. Their twittering song speaks to your soul and warms your heart. You continue along the path until you come to a gap in the fence. As you pass through the gap in the fence, you cross over the narrow, shallow stream and a single sure-footed stride sees you safely across to the other side. You take time to notice the loose rock that has fallen from the mountainside. Rock that was once formed from volcanic activity thousands of years ago. You continue along the path which begins to steepen a little until you reach the ancient yew tree grove. Three expansive yew trees come into view. Moving closer to stand before them, you gaze up in awe and feel their majestic presence. All three have strong branches that fall outward, drooping under their own weight, and they appear to be inches away from kissing the earth below. So much knowledge and wisdom stares back at you. Their energy pulses through you.
you make your way over to the center yew tree, the yew tree that has the hollowest trunk, and place yourself within the hollow void. Feeling safe and feeling supported, you close your eyes and allow your energetic body to be escorted up, up to the higher realms that is way beyond your monadic consciousness. Opening your eyes, you see that you are within a temple of light. The temple of light which holds the Christ consciousness. Everything you see is bathed in golden light. It is almost too bright for you to focus and you have to soften your gaze to adjust. With a pure white dove resting upon his soft hand, Seraphim Bopke greets you and welcomes you to the Temple of Light. He informs you that you are to receive a divine blessing and you are going to be bathed in the divine consciousness of the Christ light and that this downpouring of light will give you a greater awareness and help you to understand that you are, you are a Christed being. You focus upon the dove, resting upon Seraphim Bokpi's hand. As you focus, you see that golden light begins to cascade down. And slowly, the dove starts to alter its appearance. As the light gets stronger, Master Jesus emerges and comes to stand before you. His divine presence almost takes your breath away and yet somehow you know, you know that you have met him before. His energy is very familiar to you. Without saying a single word, he reaches out and touches your heart. From within the very centre of your heart and soul, comes a spiral and you begin to glow. As the spiral of the Christ light flows through you, light descends upon you and divine wisdom is poured into your consciousness.
as it moves through every cell of your body, it heals all cellular damage and releases all stress, tension and pain. I'm going to leave you for a little while longer whilst the healing takes place and I shall return for you in a little while. high steps forward to readjust your energetic wings allowing you to spread them wide and you prepare to fly like a free spirited bird you soar high gliding upon the warm currents you taste the freedom of air and soar to new heights that you never dreamt possible
as the love and light of the Christ light flows through you, you open your heart and sing, awakening. Your heart is filled with celebration and joy. You feel the beauty of creation within you. You say to yourself, I am my Christ self. Love flows through me. I am that I am. I am all that I am. I am all that is. I am. I am. I am. It is now time to take leave of the Temple of Light and you show your appreciation and gratitude to Master Jesus and to Seraphim Bokpi for all that you have received today. Master Jesus and Seraphim Bokpi remind you that you can return any time you wish to the Temple of Light to receive this activation. As you begin your descent down Carrying the Christ light within, the feeling of joy makes your heart flutter. Returning to the hollow tree, you step outside the void and wrap your arms around the ancient you and thank it for holding space for you. You feel the energy of the you pulsate through you once more. Now bring in your awareness back to this present day. Please energetically send your roots down and ground yourself once more. Before you leave, I'd like you to thank your higher self, your monadic family, your teams in spirit, and all the birds that have assisted with today's activation. Please also thank Archangel Mikael, Archangel Sandalfon, Master Jesus on Most Love, and Seraphim. Bokpi one more time. Go in peace and may you share the love and light within you to everyone you encounter today. And so it is.